Okay, in this video I'm going to show you a super, super handy little uh, option that is in Google Drive for your documents. So the biggest thing that, that I'm seeing with, uh, with new teachers that are, that are using uh, Google Drive and Google Docs and sharing is uh, in terms of sharing documents that you want to be able to work on together and collaboratively. So if you have uh, got, say, a Word document and you, you upload it to, to Google Drive by default, that's how it will be. It'll just be a Word document. So if you share that Word document with other people, um, you're basically just sharing that one file and you, you're not going to be able to use the uh, the tools of Google Docs, like the sharing and editing and collaborating and those kind of things as well, and working together in real time. Uh, the easiest way I can explain it is it's like if you got that that Word document, chucked it on a USB drive, gave it to your uh, gave it to another teacher, they opened it up and worked on it, they'd have to save it, bring it back to you, and then you'd have to get the newest version and, and so on and so forth. If you all were you actually editing that document, you would be editing it um, separately and it wouldn't work together. And you'll also um, break any kind of uh, collaboration that you want to do there. So Google Docs will allow you to convert a Word document into the Google Docs format, and then you can share that. So, you know, you open up your Word file, it'll open in Google Docs, and that's the one you can share. But um, I know people are working really quickly, and they want to share stuff, and so sometimes they can forget to to share that that format document. They, they haven't converted it, so they're sharing that Word document. Then we have some issues. So what Google Docs can do is do this for you automatically. Uh, if you go into the settings right up here in the corner, give that a click, uh, and then go into your settings, you'll see here, convert upload. So what this will do is it'll convert the uploaded files into Google Docs editor format. So it's basically going to convert it straight away into that format for Google Docs, which you can then share and collaborate and all that kind of stuff, and it won't have the Word documents in it. So before I check that, I'm going to show you um, how it works normally. So I'll squish out of here, and I'll... Um, down and I'll open up Word. All right. Uh, look, not my favorite word processing document, but it works. So um, here is a Word doc. And I can have pictures and all that kind of stuff, obviously. And I'm just going to save that on the desktop. And there it is there. Okay. Now, if I go into here and I go to my desktop, is my Word doc, and if I drag that in, like I normally do, you can see it's uploading, and then my Word doc will appear. There it is, and there's my Word doc. And you can see with the W um, on the icon there, it's saying that's exactly what it is, it's just a Word doc. So if I open that up to preview it, it'll be previewing the Word document, and if I share that, okay, and I go into sharing, I will just be sharing the Word document, okay, and that's it and again, so I won't be able to collaborate like I would Okay, so I'm going to down on that. Uh, how you would obviously convert it is you would open in Google Docs and it would convert it to a Google Docs format and then you would share that. Um, but then what you'll see, there it is there, ready to go. So I go back to my drive, you'll then have those two options. Okay, you can see the Word document and the Google Doc version of that. Um, and then when it comes to sharing, that's the one you want to share. But you can see how this can cause confusion because they're, they're both there. So I'll delete both of these guys. And now I'm going to go back into settings and then turn this on, convert uploaded files to Google Docs editor format. Okay, and I'm going to click done. And so now what happens is if I go in here, I get my Word doc, and I drag that little guy in. Just like before, it's uploading. Okay, it's uploading my Word document. But when it appears in here, you'll see that here it is as a Google Doc formatted document. The actual Word document isn't even there. Okay, it's ready to go. And then I'll share that and work on it. So, Look, the reason why it's not probably enabled by default in Google Drive is, look, maybe there are times where you actually want to share a Word document for people to actually have a copy of. Um, but, you know, those kind of things I would probably just email. So if you have that turned on, it'll, it'll automatically convert all your documents all the time, all right? You don't have that control. So you have to turn it off, uh, again, if you want to actually upload it as a Word document or as a PowerPoint or as an Excel document. Um, you need to make sure you turn that off. But... Um, Generally, look, I'm creating everything now in Google Docs, in their platform. Um, I just think it's way easier. So that's kind of where we're going. So you'll get to the point where you're creating everything in here anyway. You know, you're know, you not creating much on Word or Excel or PowerPoint, but, you know, there are a lot of old stuff that you might want to share. Um, and that's it. Cool. Thanks, guys.